In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can take some old phones and start mining cryptocurrency on them. Now, this isn't going to make you rich, but if you have some old phones like I do, just sitting around collecting dust, you can finally put them to work and start making money from that. So we're going to go over all of that, plus so much more. I'm your host, Tech Hustler. Oakley Doakley, welcome to another video. And if it's your first time here, my name's Tech Hustler. We mine cryptocurrency here. We stake crypto for some passive income. We even review websites and applications that you can start using right now to make some crypto on the side. So if you like that, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. And while you're down there, hit that like button too. That's the number one thing you can do to support my channel. In today's video, we're gonna go over the Scala project. Scala is a cryptocurrency that can be mined on your PC's CPU, and you can also mine it with your mobile Android device. Now, I'm sorry for you iPhone users, there is just no mobile miner for you. But first, I have to say that today's video is not sponsored, and I am not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. This is for educational and entertainment purposes only. As of the recording date of today's video, which is January 12th, 2022, the current price of Scala, and that's going to be XLA on the ticker, is 0.0001294. We're going to call it 1294 for short, up 5.57%. And if we scroll down here, we can see we had an all time high nine months ago on April 24th, 2021, of 0. 0.00 three four four nine we are down 96 percent since then now as far as markets to buy sell or trade your xla it's going to be trade org that is the only market currently and i will be completely honest with you i have never used trade org but if i keep mining scala i'm gonna have to in the future before we move on to the Scala project, I just have a quick disclaimer that I want to put out there. Now, whenever you're mining on your phone, there's only so much that that processor can do. So you're not going to make a lot. You're going to be lucky to get a couple pennies per day per phone. And, you know, speaking of the CPU, mining on your phone is going to be very taxing on that CPU. So you're not going to be able to do anything but mine crypto with that phone. And another thing that's gonna be taxed is the batteries. The batteries will get severely hot. Luckily with the app we're gonna go over today, you can control battery temperature and CPU temperature, but they can get so hot to where they start to bloat and can possibly cause your phone to catch on fire. So with that being said, that's why apps like CryptoTab are so popular. These are cloud mining apps. They're not really using the CPU or the battery powered at all. All you have to do is open up the app, check in a couple times a day, and then you can close the app and that is all you have to do. And when considering these other miners, you're gonna make about the same. So if you're interested in mining on your phone, I would definitely start with a cloud miner like CryptoTab right here. This is the paid version, but there is a free version as well. I would always try this before I try these actual crypto miners just to save your phone and to maybe save some peace of mind. Oakley Doakley, here we are on the Scala homepage. That's going to be scalaproject.io. Now, we're going to review Scala and I'm going to show you everything you need to start mining. And then we're actually going to take a look at the mining app itself and I'll show you everything we can do within my mining phone. So, Scala is an open source cryptocurrency, distributed wealth for all devices. Mine Scala on your PC and Android smart devices. I'm sorry, you iPhone users, but you know, if you're going to be in this game, you need to have at least one throwaway Android phone. I mean, you can get them for like 20 or 40 bucks. Anyways, sensitive blockchain data is stored in a P2P network and balances and transactions are invisible to others. I wanna take a minute of your time and say thank you to today's video sponsor, Stablepool.io. Stablepool is a liquidity provider for decentralized exchanges like Uniswap, SushiSwap, 
Shiba Swap, and so much Stable more. Pool's current value locked is over $160 million, and you can start earning passive income from your stable coins like USDT, USDC, DAI, and so much more. And when it comes to liquidity mining pools, they have almost every crypto you can think of. And if you have your own personal crypto, you can add liquidity here on StablePool.io as well. So if you're looking to make some passive income from some of your favorite cryptocurrencies, give StablePool.io a try today. Now back to today's video. Mining XLA on your phone is made possible by the Panthera algorithm. This is a mobile friendly proof of work algorithm that's optimized for CPU and ARM architects. Panthera is a customized hybrid algorithm combining RandomX, that's the algo for Monero, Kangaroo 12, and yes, power. It was optimized to fit more energy efficient CPU and ARM architects. Now right here, for temperature control, this is gonna keep your phone from exploding and burning down your house. We developed a machine learning, learning algorithm called AMAC, as much as you can, which prevents your mobile CPU and battery from overheating. The first thing that you're gonna need before you can start mining XLA on your PC or your Android mobile device is gonna be a Scala wallet. Now you can download a wallet straight to your PC from here, scalaproject.io, or you can go over to the Google Play Store and download their mobile wallet, the Scala Vault. Now this is very easy to set up, and once you do, do not forget your seed phrase. Copy it and write it down multiple times, because if you lose that, you lose your crypto. Here is the mobile miner, and unlike the wallet, this is not available in the Google Play Store. So you're gonna have to download the APK file, and you're gonna have to give up a little bit of permission so you can download this. But with that being said, start mining on all latest Android devices. Now they say the latest Android devices, but the phone that I'm mining on is like between four and six years old. It is severely outdated, but it is mining XLA. Now, smart devices have a more energy efficient CPU architecture than desktop computers, which makes them a great utility for mining. The mobile mining application is easy to set up and works on all smart devices powered by Android. Now, remember, this can work on multiple devices. However many phones you have, you can turn them all into crypto miners. So that's enough of the website. Let's dive in to the Scala Project Mobile Miner. Let's go. Here we are on one of my older Android phones. And if you are wondering, I run this phone strictly on Wi-Fi. Now let's go ahead and open up the Scala Miner. You can see my hash rate. 125 hashes per second which is not bad it will go up and down because i am using some recording software now like i said earlier this is going to be very taxing on your battery and if you want to save a little bit of the battery power you can click this button right here and get on performance mode and that's just going to have less on the screen another thing is you can just have this closed you know you don't have to have the app screen actively on in your face and that's going to help you save a little battery as well but you know for today's video we want to see everything now i've only been mining for a little while on this phone you can see here in the top left i'm using four of the eight threads of my cpu i've already accepted one share we've been up eight minutes now unfortunately this phone um, doesn't have a temperature monitor for the CPU. So uh, that's actually pretty important, but I'm only using four out of eight threads. So I don't think it's gonna be too bad. My minimum payout is 50 XLA. We are currently just 1% in that, but remember you can use this on multiple phones and we've only been running this for a few minutes. You can see the activity right here. We are actively mining. This is pretty crazy to be mining on a cell phone. You can see my hash rate right here and the temperature of the battery. And unfortunately, we don't have the temperature of the CPU. Now we're gonna click this graph button 
and this gives you some of your information from your pool settings your address and whatnot and also your balance and this is where you can send and receive some xla as well now let's go over here into the settings and of course there is my wallet address you can see the mining pool that i'm on scalia project this is the biggest one so i would go with that now I do have multiple phones running, so um, I should put a worker name in here, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. And you can adjust your CPU cores. I can go the max up to eight, but I'm really not worried about that right now. And then you can control your temperature parameters and a few other things as well. So you can pause mining on battery, pause mining on mobile data, keep the screen on, when mining and send debug information then we're going to click this question mark right here and that's going to take you to all the socials and everything else so not a lot to see here you know pretty cool miner like i said you're not going to make a lot but if you have some old phones lying around and hey if you have free electricity why not give it a shot and even if you are paying for your own electricity i mean what's this going to use like three to five cent a day in power. But anyways, that's gonna do it for the Scala Mobile Miner. Back to the screen of my computer. Oakley Doakley, that's pretty much gonna do it for today's video. If you thought it was a good one, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. And if you're interested in the Scala project or the Scala Miner, come over here to Twitter and give Scala HQ a follow. I'm gonna go ahead and follow them right now and stay up to date not only on the project but the mobile miner itself and maybe even send them a tweet and say tech hustler sent me and speaking of twitter and tech hustler who are you following if you're not following tech hustler or something like that so come over here show your boy some love give them a follow and other than that don't forget to like comment subscribe happy mining Peace.